What's going on YouTube? I'm Cooper. This is the Cooper Music Page and today we're going to dive a little bit deeper into the caged system. Now a little while back I showed you a little bit about the cage system showing you how you can take the shapes of the C, A, G, E, and D chords and move them all around in order up and down the neck to find your inversions. Well, then everybody asks what about B? It's not in the word caged. Okay, so let's take a look at your B. The B here is the shape of an A, but with a little finger bar here on the second fret. So it's the same thing as having an A chord just moved up two frets. So if we think of this as the A, that means next is going to be the G, so we can find our root on the E string, make our G shape, and then you get your B. C, A, G, E, right? So we find that root just like we do for the E shape here, we're gonna find it on the B and you get your E shaped B and so on and so forth. So that is how you can take any chord note, even if it's not C, A, G, E, or D, and use it in the caged system to find your inversions all across the neck. Hope this little clarification lesson helped. If it did, give us a like. Make sure you subscribe. It takes absolutely nothing from you and means absolutely everything to me. Make sure you check out our new merch at coopermusicswag.com and get your hashtag guitarlife t-shirts now. Anyways, thanks for watching everybody. And as always, keep on rocking.